hello, 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 my name is Hector. Welcome back to Enigmatica 6. We are back here. How's everyone doing? Last episode, we got started with some occultism, uh, and I've still got my little guy here. I, I sort of... There we go. He's still there. I, I, I kind of imprisoned him a little bit. Uh, so we've still got him if I needed him. Uh, and I've just done a little bit of prep work, basically. And what I've got here is a another... I don't know, pentacle, uh, and you can see this gold, gold chalk, which I made, uh, and I just basically stole all the things from that bit, uh, plus some crystals, so I've got gold, silver, silver, and then these lenses, and then I've got this, exactly the same folio, and that should do the thing? Is that, is that it? Did I, did I do the thing? I feel like I did, I have done the thing. There was a sound effect there. I presume I have done it, but uh, let me just show you what I've kind of uh, been up to. Basically, so we started off with that. I just got that by making that. So I got some uh, crushed endstone, even though I used our little crusher spirit to get some crushed endstone because you needed it for one of these two. Golden chalk, purple chalk. So that's what I've been doing. This is what we're trying to make, by the way. Other world goggles. How's everyone doing, by the way? I hope you're all doing well and having a good old day. Otherworld goggles allow you to see otherworldly materials without the need to eat the demon's dream fruit. Uh, they will not, however, allow you to interact with these items. Very useful for mining Isnium. Isnium. Don't know, as it does not require the third eye effect to interact. So we, we then need to probably to interact with the Eisnium stuff. We need one of these bad boys. So that's a, ooh, that's a Ginny one, which is different. Uh, but binding, okay, yeah, mm, we can do that. Is this doing anything? Oh, yes, it is doing anything. There you go, look, look, it is getting the stuff. This does take a little bit of time. Oh, there, there's the last one. Um, So I... Oh, and here it is. This is this is what I've been using basically to to do it all. And it sort of tells you activate. It tells you what book pentacle. It tells you what one to do, and then the ingredients, which is you know rather nice and all good. Um. So then, then the next bit would be uh, the infused pickaxe, I guess. Otherworld ores usually can only be mined with an otherworld metal tools. Now I. Ah, usually it says, but I think you can also mine some of them at least if you eat the fruit. Uh, infused pick makeshift solution to this chicken and egg problem. Brittle spirit attuned gems house a genie that allows harvesting the ores, but durability is extremely low. So, wow, a lot more stuff. So, genie, uh, spirit attuned pickaxe head, inga, inga, two sticks. I get you, I get you. What's that one? Some of these are sort of hard to see. Uh, yeah, that's a slightly different one. Bind Genie. Okay. Oh, oh yes. Infused lenses. Right. Um, so now, ahaha, ahaha, ha uh, Can we? Yes, you. That. Uh, what have I not got? That. That. Lovely stuff. Bam. Bam. Otherworldly goggles. Now, is this a thing that I can put on my head? I have no idea. Is that... Yeah. Can I put you here? No. Does that literally have to come off and go on there? Oh, wow, it does. That's a bit of a... That's a bit of a... A little bit... Of, that's like a mini pain that I I have to do that. Um, but that is good that we have it. Like, that's a, that's a nice thing to do. Yeah, it's a bit of a shame that that can't be like in one of my slots so a pickaxe let's just have a little look um so this one so we need a, a genie um in that durability 60 wow and that allows us to get this easnium stuff which is this uh i don't know how we get it really but okay and then we can make one basically and that has yeah a much much stronger now i don't know if we can sort of cheat this a little bit by getting the, the infused pickaxe and um like putting you know put putting like a, an enchantment on that i don't know so what i'm going to do i'm going to make one of these and see um you sort of see you know you, you kind of see how this is working i'm going to basically i'm i'm going to just keep making some of these like filling this out um, and then just sort of, I don't know, using whichever one I need, I guess. I should probably make a note of which one is which, but 
Uh, I feel like that is some kind of thing that has to do with organization and and that is not that is not a thing that I do so I'm just gonna struggle on struggle onwards ah yes so I was getting all of this ready uh to do the pickaxe thing but then I I was just checking off rewards and for that I got I got four what is it four Isnium Isnium ingots so I can literally just make one of these now so I <laughs> I find I yeah for so I I've kind of I I don't really need to do that now we need to more easily and we will need to get at some point uh, otherworld or found in the Nether um so you can otherworld goggles yeah rod yes okay so we've got all of that basically you will need uh, infused pickaxe or an easium pickaxe to do that. So, Isnium? Ah oh, man, I don't know easium. Um, I'm gonna say easium. Um, so. I feel like yeah, I don't need to do that now. I this is the what I'm what I'm vaguely attempting to sort of plow my way onto is these things. The dimensional mine shaft opens up a portal to an uninhabited dimension that is full of all kinds of ores just waiting to be mined. Only problem is the portal is too small for a normal human to fit. This is not a problem for spirits, however. You will need to summon one of the mining spirits to acquire the ores for you. Uh, and then there's the miner folio and then uh, a miner gin. Ginny. Gin. Um, so, uh, and this is obviously where genies come from, as you can see, because there's lamps and whatnot, uh, which is all very exciting. So, uh, this is what I'm going to try and do. Dimensional mine shaft. So, we need another... Ginny thing for that. Let's have a look in uh, our book of spirits. Um, entry index, pentacle spirits, rituals, uh, item possessed stuff. Oh yeah, we can possess things. I've I've not looked at any of this stuff um, because well, I haven't. There we go. Uh, Stridges higher binding. Uh, is that the one that I've just... Yeah, Bind Ginny. There you go. This is the one that I've just done. So actually, ha, ha, ha. That is still great. Four other stone. Um, one Easium block. That's a lot. Spirit Tune Crystal. Uh, that's one of those. And that. Okay. That is like a lot of ingredients. I don't... That's only got four things. So I don't know where we put everything. I'm guessing the other stone maybe can we can just put in a all-in-one doohickey. Okay, so let's go to the nether and see if we can find any of this stuff, because that would be nice. I'm in the nether, and I've I've got this attuned to Easnium, which you do on netherrack. So you shift right-click on netherrack, then you hold right-click like that. It does the thing, and there you go. Look at that. It's it's sort of um, giving me some. Uh, and there there it is. Um, yeah, you need to do it with the old uh, Easnium pick and there we go i've got four already now if you look at the uses um you can do that can we uh enrich it yes we can just enrich it as well and then double it as well so that's quite nice we can do that and that's no problem i think you can also use your crusher doodad um i've come to the nether rack section of the nether as well just because i i figured it was going to be better oh 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 there's another one Ha <laughs> ha uh, ha! Ow! 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 Uh, yeah, I should have. I should have thought about that, shouldn't I? Should have thought about that. So I'm going to spend some time. Uh, get myself. Uh, I guess as much as I can, really. And then we're going to try and get a dimensional shaft up and running. And um, yeah, see what this minor doodads can do. That'd be that'd be kind of cool. Okay, I'm back here, and I'm. I've got a problem. I have a slight problem. So it's said in this little doohickey heat for other stone in the ingredients. But it doesn't allow us to put in, like, you know, more than one, basically. You know, and I can't just do that. It's shift-click, anything like that. That doesn't work. What about control-click? Nope, that's, that's still the same. Okay, so I figure we can... Oh, no, 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 no. Uh oh. Uh, I think we're we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're okay. Right. Um. Yeah. I figure we can just do that. Maybe. I don't. I don't know. 
Uh, and I've definitely, I've definitely knocked off a thing there. I hope that's the, that's the right one. I think it is. Okay, seriously. That, that, that. So that's four of those. You can see the four blocks. Gold ingot. Uh, gold ingot. Spread attuned crystal and an easium block, right? So that should be correct. But Oh, yes, yes. It's done it. It did the thing. It works. So, yeah, just putting more of those on uh, will do it, basically. So I'm going to wait for that to happen. Whilst I'm sort of waiting, I think we can also make a lamp. Um, I love lamp. So there we go, because I think we need that for the next sort of thing, which is uh, uh, dimensional. No, let's go here. Minor spirits. There. Minor spirits use dimensional mine shafts to acquire resources from other dimensions. They are summoned and bound into magic lamps, which they can leave only through the mine shaft. The magic lamp degrades over time. Once it breaks, the spirit is released back into the other place. Folio man miner harvest blocks without much aim returns anything it finds. Uh, yeah, okay. Um, that's one. Gini miner harvest ores specifically. Oh, okay. The greater power of the Gini. Uh, it ah the greater power of the genie damages the magic lamp relatively quickly. Okay, uh, that's that's the same pentacle, and that is one that we've already done as well. Uh, that does, and that just does everything. Hmm. I feel like whilst this is fun, I I can't imagine that this is sort of in the same realm as you know anything that we already have like the bees which have kind of stopped working for me again and um like our digital miner and uh, industrial foregoing and anything basically thingy like that but i figure you know we well i'll i'll try so i'm going to i'm going to do this and then we'll we shall see uh we shall see for the actual I guess this one. I wonder if I can just go to this one immediately. Yeah, that magic lamp, Isnium pickaxe, oh, Isnium block. Oh, yeah, that's all right. I can do all that. I can totally do all that. Nice. I got one. I got the dimensional mine shaft. I've got to say, the mine shaft took a while to sort of do its thing. The the Ginny actually pretty pretty quick. Now I just went and enchanted it, and I got him breaking five on it. I thought that would maybe maybe work i don't know durability 100 out of 100 um i don't think there's anything in this pack uh that basically allows you to i like maybe if i had mending on it um we could like keep <laughs> we could keep using it i don't know man i don't know but you can sort of see what all the um like what all the i guess the the stuff is what i thought we'd do um is i think I think we can basically do something like this. So if I do that, yes. Um like the that. So pull. Oh no, that's not what I wanted. Uh so there we go. This is that uh, essentially. And I think if we just do that, it does stuff, will it? Mine random Oh, there we go. Yes, it is doing a thing. So let's see. If the unbreaking works, it shouldn't necessarily take a durability point off it. Um, that's not actually there. Uh, are you doing the thing? Are you going to do the thing? So it's a little bit slow. A little bit slow. Oh, two of those. And I feel like that hasn't actually done it yet. Lead and iron. So I guess what I'm going to do is basically just leave this here for a little bit and sort of see what we get with it. Um... It's got nature's mend on it, range, teleportation, the luck of cheap repairing, which is interesting, but I don't think, again, I don't think I can, I don't think I've got anything that can. Oh, it took, oh, oh, look at that. <gasps> look at that. Look, the durability has now gone to 5,000. That is interesting. So, I would imagine that means that I could put mending on this right surely and then just keep like i don't know just keep doing it like that i feel like that's 
super cheeky uh, and maybe not at all what was meant to happen. That's actually pretty good now. That I feel like that I'm you know what and I'm I've just put this here because I'm sort of interested to see how much we get out of it. Um, you know what we what we sort of get. Um, It's only had one. So it's mind all of that. It's taken one durability point off it. That's not too bad. I feel that's pretty good. Um, have I got anything else that I've sort of... I see I've got... N none of this I've unlocked because I didn't do the infused pickaxe. But I don't... I didn't sort of need to. Um, you can get... You can get wither skulls uh, using the wild hunt, which is interesting. You can also uh, trap mobs. So like using the the thingy that I had. And there's this whole dimensional storage kind of system. And I really don't quite know. I, I'm, I am intrigued by it, but I don't know if it's worth doing for me. Uh, possessed Enderman. Mm, that's interesting. Um, I am sort of tempted by that. Uh, folio. Uh, I don't what's What is that? What is this? I don't know if I've got time for it right now. Um substantial data uh as as he vs spectral compulsion uh chest silver ingot leather string that's pretty uh, that's not too much i think that's the second one that we have yeah it is okay i might quickly do that just to sort of see what we get interesting i have the surprisingly substantial satchel um which is pretty good like it's as big as my large backpack i think i think it looks like it to me um that's pretty good like that's pretty that's pretty decent my my little backpack isn't you know and i'm just doing that i'm just putting food in there because i've got the automate feeding upgrade stuff in there uh, and that is what i'm doing there but that's uh it's pretty big and i get something for that for that minus delight and i get some oh epic oreo sure not eating that. Okay, I uh, get some more chunks. Um, let's just do that. Bam, put that in there. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Because that's gonna give us like stuff, isn't it? Yeah. Let's just. Uh, no, let's just put that about there. There we go. Um, so we've got that. We've done all right here. And uh, there we go. And I've got to say, this is sort of. It's chugging away, man. It's chugging away, and this is... I'm not going to put that in there because that's going to taint everything. Um, I feel like I could gen maybe genuinely actually use this. It's maybe a bit slow, Um, is, is perhaps the only thing. And it's a bit of a shame that you can't, like, you know, like a... Like the laser thing from um, Industrial Foregoing, you can't like just pick a thing or like make it a little bit more attuned to one thing. But like we're getting uranium, that's not bad. Uh, we're just basically getting everything. And how, how, there we go, 12. 12 uh, durability it's taken off us. I mean, that was meant to be 100. Uh, and instead, yeah, it's, it's mm -hmm, 5,000. So that's pretty good. So I think we've done well. Um, when we've not done too bad, maybe I might I might have a look into the storage. I don't know. We shall see. I I might I might try something else though next episode. Thank you all very much for hanging out. Hopefully, you've enjoyed this little uh, foray into occultism. Bit of a new mod, so it's nice nice to have a little you know faff around with that. So thank you all. I've been Hector. This has been Enigmatica Six on my Patreon server. I do twitching as well, so check that out as well. Uh, and I will hopefully see you in the next one. Bye-bye.